Okay, friends, what's up? How are you? Welcome. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, I'm Chanel. What's good? I'm your resident movie watching BFF. This is the channel where we watch movies together because we're best friends. And I just let you know what's going on the whole time in my noisy, noisy little brain as I'm watching these movies. I'm a student of film in that. I am watching them for you. And we're dissecting them from a little bit of a filmmaking perspective. I say little bit because I didn't go to film school. So this is my film school. Any who. Um, today we are watching Top Gun Maverick from 2022. I basically failed miserably at getting to see this in theaters and everyone's texting me like, you gotta go, you gotta go. They know me. My friends know me really well and they're like telling me I have to go. So maybe a little part of my psyche knew that I needed to screen this for the YouTube channel. So I've watched Top Gun 1986 on the channel before. It was a rewatch. I had seen it before, but it had been like a decade. So I felt comfortable enough to watch it again. I had forgotten a ton of in it and now we're doing Top Gun Maverick a sequel I love a sequel on the channel I have no problems with sequels I have no problems when they rehash an old plot line I almost expect it and I can't wait for it Top Gun Maverick what do I know I'm hoping to dear god that they bring the songs back so I want to hear you lost that love and feeling I want to hear that one I want to hear Great Balls of Fire I could be wrong or I could not be wrong is Tom Cruise a teacher now? Maybe. I think he's a teacher. And I think Miles Teller is playing Goose's son. Maybe. that. Those are my two guesses slash not really guesses because I'm pretty sure someone would have told me those things. Take it up with them, am I right? Other than that, I'm expecting ego. Ego, ego, ego. Top Gun is a macho man movie. It is very macho. I'm expecting men to get in other men's faces and do a lot of close talking like you're dangerous, but you could be my wingman any day. <laughs> you know, stuff like that. I'm hoping for more shirtless beach pics. Pics, not pictures. I'm looking for more shirtless beach scenes. I just hope that they make a really earnest blockbuster popcorn flick while also hammering on the cheese. Please give me callbacks to all the that we make fun of Top Gun for. I said it in my first watch, I'm saying again, like I love how corny Top Gun can be. And my golly gee, without further ado, let's get right into today's video, which is, I'm getting really, I'm getting so excited that there's like emotion drumming up behind my eyes. Why am I having this reaction? Which I just feel like there's a before and after, like there's a before Top Gun Maverick and then there's an after and you're, I'm about to, I'm about to know. Oh my God, okay, um, without further ado, let's get right into today's video, which is Top Gun Maverick from 2022. Oh my god, it already sounds like the original. This is how the original opens. <laughs> I have a lot. I'm like really excited. March 3rd, 1969. <laughs> Top Gun! <laughs> it's like all Top Gun, come on. This is how, this is how the first one opens. Men and women. I don't know if the original included women. I don't remember. I think it said men only. <laughs> Jennifer Connelly, I love her. I, I remember she was in this. She's so beautiful. John Hamm. Guys, this is gonna be a lot for me. This is gonna be a lot. This is exactly how the first one opens. I am unwell. I am not okay right now. <sighs> the more repeat scenes we can get, the better. And that is the back of Tommy Boy's head. Goose. Goosey. Oh my God, bring Meg Ryan back, please. Thank God, please. I have full body chills. It's my favorite thing that happens. The glasses, the bike. Is this about to be my new favorite movie of all time? The contract threshold is Mach 10. Mach 10 is supposed to be in two months. Today's test point is Mach 9. Well, that's not good enough. Says who? It's one of the most beautiful wide shots I've ever 
Why? Let's give him up 10. Oh, Maverick. Not following the rules again. Not 10.1, not 10.2, Mach 10. Rear Admiral Chester Kane. Kane just pulled up to the gate. You know what happens to you if you go through with this. Fired? Increased to Mach 3.5. Okay, all right. I'm starting to understand. Mach must mean speed or power or something. You care to explain? Transitioning to screen. Well, his name's Maverick, and he doesn't follow the rules. Passing up by 0.4 and... This is where we've had trouble with comms, sir. It's the Earth's curvature. What a silly freaking goose. <gasps> goose. Remember Goose? R.I.P. 8.9. Mach 9. He's the fastest man alive. He was supposed to only hit 9 today, and this mother said think again 10 come on just do it just give it to him it's tom cruise Mark 10. <laughs> put that in your pentagon but <laughs> suck it government <laughs> just no no he's trying to go to one he's gonna go to one this bitch <laughs> Swear to God, is this like the greatest character in cinematic history or what? <laughs> Maverick. How many millions of dollars did he just destroy? <sighs> that was intense. That was so intense and so wonderful. Where am I? Uh. <laughs> you should be at least a two-star admiral by now. Yet here you are. What is that? I got the need for speed. For reasons known only to the almighty and your guardian angel, you've been called back to Top Gun. <laughs> Cue the theme, baby. Hear it? Do we hear it? It's a little bit of percussion. Gorgeous, gorgeous. This movie is so... Beautifully shot. Did we expect anything less? Your reputation precedes you. Ham. Thank you, sir. John Hambone. Must admit I wasn't expecting an invitation back. They're called orders, Maverick. <laughs> I'm not familiar. That is one hell of a steep climb out of there. It's a dogfight all the way home. I'm not sure who I trust to fly the other three, but I'll find a way to make it work. I think you misunderstand, Captain. Sir? We don't want you to fly it. We want you to teach it. They'll fly the mission. Oh no, Rooster and Goose. Goose is kid. K.A. Rooster. I understand he used to fly with his old man. What was his call sign? Goose. Goose, sir. I'm not a teacher. This is so beautiful. You're Look at this close-up. You are not my first choice. In fact, you aren't even on a list. <laughs> you were here at the request. John Ham. Mean. He seems to think that you have something left to offer the Navy. What that is, I can't imagine. Mean macho energy. What did I say? What did I say? Pete. Penny? It's not Charlie. As improbable as it seems right now, somehow you'll be back in a fighter. I, I'm in shock right now. This is some of the best lens work I've ever seen in a movie. Like, the best cinematography. Okay. Re reignite an old flame. I'm down. I'm ready. Her name's Penny. Let's do it. Fellas, this here's Bagman. Hangman. Whatever. Is that Baby Ice Man? Who are your friends? Payback. Fanboy. Hey, Coyote. Hey. There's so much macho energy and there are women. I'm obsessed with this. They included a lady. Show me. Yes. <laughs> it's good to see you. Good to see you too. Yes, Trace. Hangman, the only place you'll lead anyone is an early grave. You are dangerous. I just love this. A fuel. Well, that's just you and Rooster. <laughs> Why are they using each other's names so much? Like a threat. Rooster. <laughs> no, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not gonna do it. What? Overboard? Does he have to go in the water? 
Oh, just on the sand. Okay. I knew he was going to do Great Balls of Fire. I fucking knew it. Goodness gracious, Great Balls of Fire! FBC's Full Body Chills. Look at the film grain. Chills on my face. They went for it in this movie. They went for it. They said, we're not going to spare you anything. We're going to give you the flashbacks. Because they didn't have to do this. They don't have to use any archival footage. They could just have Mav looking at young Rooster and be like, wow, I remember dad. I'm so emotional. Whoa, gorgeous. Now more than ever, it comes down to the man or woman in the box. Man or woman. Ladies. I give you Captain Pete Mitchell. Call sign, Maverick. Oh, does he blame him? I'm assuming you know the book, Inside and Out. Damn right. Yeah. Damn straight. You got it. So does your enemy. But what the enemy doesn't know. Good dialogue. Blow if you have. He goes hard. Trying to get kicked out? Don't worry about it. But if you get kicked out, you leave us flying with Hangman. He pulled my application in the Naval Academy. Why would he do that? <sighs> to protect me. That could have got all three of you killed. I never want to see that shit again. I loved it. <laughs> do that again. And how to strike the target. And how to come home. That's who. Hey, how's your dad? Who's his wife in Hawaii? Mom! Mommy's single. I can help. Yay, love story time. Let's go. No rougher than I was expecting. You know Take me out of the air and bring me to the sea, Captain. Now you're in the Navy. Cute. I still want to hear Take My Breath Away, though. I really hope they give it to us, but I doubt they're going to because that was the him and Charlie thing, right? Good night, Pete. Good night, Penny. They were so cute. <laughs> I love when two hot people look at each other in a movie. It's just great. Hit your target and be gone before these planes even have a chance of catching you. This makes time your greatest adversary. Oof, this is a good screenplay. So much conflict, so many adversaries. The tighter the turns, the more intensely the force of gravity on your body multiplies. <sighs> so for today's lesson, we're gonna take it easy on you. Time to target three minutes. Oh my God, you're gonna kill somebody. It's my fault. Was there a reason you didn't communicate with your team? I was focusing on- One that their family will accept at the funeral. None, sir. Okay. Tell him to his family. Hey, man. Oh my God. In an F-18. It's not the plane, sir. It's the pilot. Exactly. And you suck. On this mission, a man flies like Maverick here, or a man does not come back. No offense intended. Yet somehow, you always manage. <laughs> Good lines. It's no time to be thinking about the past. What do you mean? What's that supposed to mean? I can't be the only one that knows that Maverick flew with his old Lieutenant. man. Lieutenant, that's it. You're all dismissed. Yikes. It's come back. No one knows. There's nothing else they can do. Is Ice gonna go? Damn, this movie hitting you like in the heart, in the gut, in the... Whew. <coughs> Wow. What can I do for you? A rooster's still angry with me about what I did. The mission is less than three weeks away. The kid's not ready. Don't ask me to send him. Send me. I'm so excited. This is how you sequel. <sighs> the only reason I'm here is you. If I send him on this mission, he might never come home. And if I don't send him, he'll never forgive me. The Navy. Let it be an insult. The kid needs Maverick. That's why you're still here. Who's the better pilot? You or me? 
This is a nice moment. Let's not ruin it. <laughs> God, I love him. Cool symmetry. No, no, we are not about to play beach volleyball. Tell me they're. This is mirroring the volleyball scene from the first. It's like the same lighting, it's that golden hour light. And they put Tom in jeans. It's so good. Said to create a team, sir. Hmm, there you go. Take my breath away. <laughs> well, that'd be cool. I'm still waiting. Is this a love making scene? Is this a love making scene? Damn, okay. They're doing that. We need some drape, we need some drapery. His mother never wanted him to fly. She made me promise before she died, so. She's dead too, Meg Ryan. <laughs> Is she ready now? You know what I mean. <laughs> this is not our first date. But this is the last time I go out your window. No, no, I mean it. I'm never gonna leave you again. Oh, shut up. Okay, all right. Maybe if you get fired. <laughs> Just don't break her heart again. Get it, Amelia. What a good daughter. Pete Mitchell. The uranium enrichment plant that is your target will be operational earlier than expected. <sighs> your mission has been moved up one week. Requiring nothing less than two consecutive miracles. A laser-guided bomb on an exposed ventilation hatch. That's miracle number one. Okay. IG climb out to avoid hitting this mountain. You're pulling at least eight Gs. Nine. Two thousand pounds. Your skull crushing your spine, <laughs> fighting with everything you have. Hey, coyote! You okay? I'm okay. Bird strike! Bird strike! Grab the engine's on fire! Climbing! After all that, bird strike? Can't control it! We're going down, man! We're going in! We're going to eject! 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 Oh, that's how he survived the 10 G's thing. Don't let him be dead, please. We'll keep Phoenix and Bob in the hospital overnight for observation. They're gonna be okay. Hospital, not death. There will be others. Easy for you to say. No kids. Go home. Why did you stand in my way? You think up there you're dead. Believe me. My dad believed in you. I'm not going to make the same mistake. No. <laughs> this movie's trying to kill me. Take some time, whatever you need. Time? His mission's like in like seven days. I'll be taking over the training from here. <laughs> You will. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? What choice do I have? You wouldn't just give up. Those are your pilots. Yeah, Pete. I don't know what to do. Have you ever seen prettier close-ups in your whole life? Jesus Christ. It's so pretty, this movie. They just really nailed it. Nailed it! Target is now four minutes. You'll be entering the valley level at reduced speed. Not to exceed 420 knots. <laughs> what? Oh. oh my god, Maverick. He's gonna show him it can be flown. <gasps> Green Range. No. Uh, Green Range is coming. No. For you, sir. Well, I'm going anyway. Nice. Getting time to target. Two minutes, 15 seconds. No f way. He's gonna do it. <laughs> this movie is like surprising me. Like, why didn't I see that coming? I definitely should have. It's Maverick. It's freaking Maverick! Ah! <sighs> I'm so excited, I'm so excited. They all lean in. Wow. Okay, all right. Miracle number one. Bombs away.
You have put me in a different <sighs> by stealing a multi-million dollar military aircraft and flying it in such a manner that it may never be airworthy again. Really? So what do I do? Put me in, coach. That's what it, you f***ing do. Risk my career by appointing you team leader. That one, bitch. I think the Admiral's asking a rhetorical question, Captain. Oh, got it. <laughs> I love this movie. It is so good. I never want this to end. Please don't let this be over. <laughs> I want to hear... You lost that love and feeling. Oh, that love and feeling. Hot. Make out. So pretty. So pretty. God dang. They went full romance lighting and romance lenses with this movie. Full romance on it. They've always got these two with the most shallow depth of field you can imagine. And they it just makes them feel like they exist in their own world. Everything is blocked out. Did you see that? There is nothing in focus besides those two. I'm holding your face and saying it's beautiful. You're where you belong. I know. <laughs> it's been an honor flying with you. Each one of you. Full body chills. So many chills. Choose your two Foxtrot teams. Payback and Fanboy, Phoenix and Bob. And your wingman. Which one, which one, which one? Rooster. Dismissed. This is him making it up to him for pulling the papers, right? I wouldn't want the mission, you know? I would say, you have it. <laughs> Don't pick me. We'll talk. We get back. I don't see you again, Hondo. Close-ups, 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 close-ups. I'm so emotional. I think that everything's going to be fine. Right, guys? Do I think Maverick maybe doesn't make it? I don't know. That would be an epic ending, but it would be out of character because Maverick always wins. Except for that time he was second best in school that one time. <laughs> Dagger two, up and ready. Oh, this is for real. This is Tom Cruise flying. That this is that's no green screen. Ah, oh, I think Tom Cruise drove off of that boat. Daggers, assume attack formation. It's amazing. It's like ballet. Two mark. Three mark. Four mark. First Sam sight overhead. No one told me it was gonna be snowy. I'm like holding my breath right now. They're headed away from us. They don't know we're here. Daggers two and four are behind schedule. Come on, kids. Step on it. <gasps> Come on, Rooster. Bandits inbound. We gotta make up time now. Move it or lose it. Step on it, Roost. Talk to me, Dad. Got it captured. Target acquired. Bombs away. <sighs> Pull it up. Boy, where's my laser? Who's sure there's something wrong with his laser? <sighs> bombs away. Bombs away. Defended him, but I got Mav. I kind of had a hunch that maybe he would die, but he he never dies, so maybe he ejected. What about Maverick? Negative there. Rooster, he's gone. He better not be. Thank fuck. Thank God, I knew it. But like, no, but like I said, no one told me there was gonna be snow. No one told me about the snow. Oh. Oh. 
feels so intense. It feels so emotional. <sighs> Rooster, who is it? It's Rooster. Is he kidding me? <laughs> Dagger 2 is hit. Dagger 2, come in. What's this deal? You alright? Yeah, I'm good. You alright? <laughs> Why would you do that? What the hell were you even thinking? You told me not to think. They should kiss now. It's good to see you. It's good to see you too. So what's the plan? Campsite. <laughs> An F-14? I shot down three megs on one of those. Let's find out. Ref. They did this in the first one too. The enemy was always unnamed. Like we didn't have um we didn't we don't have a country. Diplomatic, I guess. Right? <sighs> it's been a minute, huh, Matt? Did he fly one of these in the first movie? I think so. He's like, I got it. I got this. Very short taxiway, Mav. He's just hanging on. He knows what he's doing. His name is Maverick. His name is Tom Cruise. I'm gonna take out the wheels. Yup, yup, yup. No landing gear now. It can't be. It can't be. Maverick. Put your mask on. Remember, we're on the same team. Fly like a team. Don't think. Just do. Don't think, just do. Everything really does boil down to use the force, doesn't it? Boost your flares! No, no, no! Splitting. Miss? He's still on us! It's like fine with Goose again. Come on, man, do some of that pilot Brace yourself! Here. Come on, Mav, do some of that pilot <laughs> Out of missiles! Switching to guns! I love that this ends on a dog fight. This is so great! <laughs> yes! Splash two! <sighs> Time to go home, friends. Time to go home. Let that be it, unless this is an aliens scenario and mama's in the elevator. If you know, you know. Where the hell is this guy? That was <sighs> Hangman, we need we need uh, the other teammates. Rooster, pull the handle, eject! It's not working! I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Who was it? Who was it? Who was it? Yes. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your savior speaking. Knew it. Knew it. I'll see you back on. I'm. What the fuck did I just watch? <laughs> oh man. Maverick is downwind. No front landing gear. Maverick no tail hook. is like. The cable. Brought you guys a plane. I hope you like it. <laughs> Somebody should have spilled their coffee at that moment, and then it would have been a callback to one. Hire me. Hire me. <laughs> this f***ing movie! <sighs> Full body chills. Be my dad. <laughs> Sir. Thank you for saving my life. That's what my dad would have done. The score. <laughs> so beautiful. Did she say when she'd be back? That's what my dad would have done is still killing me.
the Porsche. Uh... Take so long. It's so pretty. Lady Gaga's gonna bring us home. Go till the end. So cry. They all have a lot of names. <laughs> that was really well done. Well, we'll file that one away in mental breakdowns for the channel, okay? I'm so sad. <laughs> Miss Goose. I'm gonna need a minute. Cleaned up my face. Top Gun Maverick. That was as good as everyone was saying it would be. I really liked that. It was like a totally new, modern, different movie while calling back the first one just enough. And I respect, I respect the choices that they made. I respect that they did the beach scene, right? And I respect that they mirrored a lot of like the rivalries from the first while also being like minorly heartbroken that there's no take my breath away or there's no, um you've lost that love and feeling and there was no, they didn't play it like that opening song they gave us, but they didn't bring it back throughout. Like I respect where they went for the cheese of the first one and then where they decided to go against it. So it was really, really good. I loved that. I loved bringing back Iceman. Um, this movie really messes with your heart, man. They are trying to kill me. We don't have Goose. We don't have Goose's wife, Meg Ryan. Like what? Uh, let me gather myself for a second. You want to know what else I respect? They could have brought back he's in need and need for speed, right? Because I would have forgiven him for that one. We, I, it's a sequel, man. I want to see that. But they kind of gave us a new one in the opening when Mav is hitting over 10 Mach 10, and he goes, he's the fastest man in the world. Kind of a new iconic line, right? So I just think that this movie succeeds in every way as, as a sequel and succeeds in every way as its own movie. It is completely its own movie. You can watch this and enjoy it without seeing Top Gun 1986, one of my favorite movies of all time. This is just a good fucking movie. That's, that's that on that. I would say that we have to give major kudos to the cinematographer. I don't know what I'm calling this budget wise. $150 million movie probably. Um, would have loved a better sex scene between the two of them. Cause the first one was steamy. This one was eh, whatever. I think we'll go right into the trivia section and talk about Tom Cruise being, you know, doing his own stunts, cause I'm sure he did. Okay, so this was a estimated $170 million budget. The World War II P-51 Mustang, Mustang scene in this movie is actually Tom Cruise's own airplane. He's an accomplished pilot in real life. I mean, did we expect anything less from him? Oh, according to Miles Teller, the cast got to choose their own call signs. He chose Rooster cause it was the same family as Goose at the insistence of Tom Cruise. Yup, minimal green screen and CGI aerial shots exist in the film. And even the close-up cockpit shots were taken during real in-flight sequences. What? Blowing my f***ing mind. Whoa, the actors playing pilots not only had to film themselves, turning the camera on and off, they also had to touch up their own makeup, adjust their lighting, and handle their own sound. I mean, it looked real and it looked good, but I just thought, wow, CGI has come a long way and actors joined professional pilots to hit the skies for 90 minutes at a time, a few times per day. This meant that Claudio Miranda, who relied on the sun as his primary light source, prepped each day by studying flight paths and weather patterns in order to set camera exposures before liftoff. <laughs> the shirtless beach football montage had to be shot twice because Tom Cruise did not find the first version good enough. Reshoot placed additional pressure on the actors to get their their ripped bodies back 
wow, they were really shredded up. The opening text matches that of the original movie, that was my guess, except insure has now been changed to ensure, and men and women was added. Yep, I did catch that, that's cool. From the actor's bodies conveying strain of sustaining G-forces in the air to jet wings flapping realistically and beyond, the practical imperfections captured on film give the cinematography of Maverick its unique texture and power. So they're saying they kept the imperfections. I didn't clock imperfections, by the way. The filmmakers decided not to clean up one aspect of their aerial photography that keen eyed viewers might notice, the barely perceptible reflection of the cameras in some shots. At the insistence of Miles Teller, he learned to play Great Balls of Fire on the piano himself without a double. Whoa, okay, I'm gonna be here all day. So that's that for my trivia section on Top Gun Maverick. Did you do better than me and see this on IMAX? Please let me know, comment down below. What do you think of this? And I mean, you guys, if you've been here for at least one video, you know. I'm gonna go eat.